Hi, I'm Rishi, and welcome to Workado for Admins. In this series, we will get you familiar with all the tools available in Workado to manage your workspace, teams, automations, and much more. Account settings is a great place to start for controlling the experience of your workspace. In this video, I'll cover some aspects of the account settings, like creating a unique profile, keeping your account secure with session timeouts, and setting up notifications for critical updates. All right, so let's get started. The first thing to set up is the profile for your workspace. Giving your workspace a unique and meaningful name makes it easy for your team to identify the workspaces they'll work in. My team and I build automations for our product-led growth initiatives, so I'll set the name of this workspace to product-led growth. From here, I'll also add a photo that provides a visual cue to identify the product-led growth workspace. I'll select a custom image our amazing design team has made just for us and attach it here. The goal is to make it distinguishable for my team to easily find and work in the right workspace. As you can see here, our marketing team at Workado has a workspace named Marketing, and our HR folks have a workspace named Human Resources, so you get the idea. Next, I'll provide my login email as the workspace owner to log into the account and receive important updates and communications like password reset and product updates. A good practice is to use an email alias that some members of your team have access to so that you don't miss out on important updates and communications if someone is on vacation or unavailable. I'll set my email to pe-plg at workado.com. Next, let's talk about protecting your workspace. The session timeout duration allows you to stay logged into your Workado account for a duration that suits your needs. I can set the session timeout period from anywhere between 15 minutes to 14 days. A 15 minute timeout session will prompt me to log in after I've been idle for that time. While this can be counterproductive, a shorter duration reduces the risks of someone else accessing the account. A 14 day session timeout duration, on the other hand, may be great for productivity, but does increase the risks of the account being compromised. To keep a good balance between security and productivity, I'll pick a four hour period. It's also important that you set up email notifications for your workspace. Now it's important to note that email notifications are distinct from the login email provided earlier on the accounts page. Email notifications allow you to send specific and relevant alerts and details to members of your team. Admin notifications allow for the people managing the workspace to receive important communications about recipe usage, security alerts, user activity, billing information, and much more. For these notifications, I'll use the email alias our admins monitor, which is plg-admin at workado.com. And last but not least, error email notifications are a way to alert you when an exception or error occurs. These alerts keep you informed so you can take action to resolve issues faster and ensure the uptime of your business and mission critical recipes. For these alerts, I'll send them to the email alias that our operations team uses, which is pe-plg-ops at workado.com. However, not all recipes are as important. Some are more critical than others and require immediate attention when exceptions occur. I'll turn on notifications only for projects that contain the mission critical recipes, such as our order to cash projects because of sensitive customer and financial data, as well as ticket escalations, so we can always keep track of support requests. Just a few easy steps and settings will allow you to personalize and protect your account while keeping you informed about your team's automations. If you want more tips on how to get started, check out some more of our videos for admins.